So hey guys, welcome back into another video. Today I'm basically doing this is like the YouTube day because I literally just finished editing the hide and seek in the house video and now I'm gonna be showing you how to draw something very 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 realistic. So what your supplies are gonna be is a black black crayon I mean it doesn't matter just you need you need this you need a pencil and bam and then you need a some something dark doesn't matter what color just something pretty dark so I'll just use the black thing the black crayon because that's the best one I can possibly get. So you're going to start off with a touch. Basically going to be a super realistic dropper. So it doesn't matter if you don't draw perfect. Because that's just fine. Now you got to have it like this. You might think you already know this one. But you do not. Because... Gotta actually over this side, I believe. Um, over this side. Gotta make it all black. Like that. And then here. That's it. And now you're gonna start making this. So you made. There you go. Number, I mean, as much as you want. I have other ones, but I have no idea where they are. Didn't mind the drip point, didn't the garbage now. Because they're so old. But here, that's looking my dropper. You can already see that is some really, really, really confusing stuff. Now, basically, whatever pattern you want, it doesn't matter. I'm just going to do it. Uh, thing. I'm just going to use a marker because I feel like no I don't know I don't know no, no, I'm just gonna use pencil so if you use pencil right now you will be able to basically you would be able to do a certain pattern doesn't matter what I'll just do it like this and basically uh, you basically like just have to draw like this well it doesn't really matter what pattern you do you can do stars anything but just to make it the best possible that I have found it out was to just draw squares in a certain line but then if you draw that well then if you draw them then you gotta draw them on the other side so I'll just flip over my paper and do this cause I really wanna just get this done. Sorry, I'm talking so fast, I don't know why. But then basically right here, I'm just gonna fill in another one. You can probably do better than me, but I'm just speeding through this cause I have, I have a lot of work. Cause like, like what I mean by work is editing these videos. These videos take, well it only took me like 30 minutes for to edit that hide and seek video and it's definitely only take me a lot a lot a long and not that quick not that long but still even though it doesn't take me that long it's still i have a lot of videos that i want to record today if you can see this it is literally a drop you're gonna fall into that thing well not really because it's literally just an optical illusion if you can get this to work better like to make it better and everything then you're pretty skilled I actually remember that this line this middle line is supposed to have erased it's just cause it's quicker to do it if you just draw a line like this now you can see the illusion way better it's just that the line, it lets you make a pretty good illusion. 
and stuff. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the, the dropper illusion. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. And all we're going to do is I guess I'm going to make more videos, guys. So I hope you had a great time. I hope you had a nice time. So bye-bye, guys.